Hello, Graciela. How are you? Hello. Good evening. Fine. And you, teacher? How was Thanks. your day? Excellent. Thank you. It was too short. Really? Yes. You have very was, tight, very busy. I was very, very busy. Oh, yes. That's... There we go. Yes. Uh, whenever that's... someone, whenever oh, someone okay. says it was too short because it was fiz, yeah, very busy, or it was uh, very funny. Yeah. You know, a lot of fun. So, time flies. Yesterday it was. Time, time flies when um, you're having fun. Yes. Okay. There you go. Hi, uh, Laura. Oh, time flies. How do you spell? Time Hi. flies, time flies whenever you are having fun. Time flies whenever you are having fun. Time, T-I-M-E, flies, F-L-Y-I-E-S. Yes. Whenever you are having fun. Hi, Laura. Laura Raquel. Hello. How are you? Hello. Good evening. Hello. Yes, good evening. Hi, Miguel. Lara, how are you? Hi. Good evening. Good evening, sir. And Tirso Cermeño, how are you? Uh, good teacher. Good. Excellent. Good. You look tired, uh, Cermeño. What's wrong? Really? No. Yes. I feel. Yes. No, no, no. No? It's, okay. It's good. Oh, okay. So uh, maybe you're serious, right? But uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, very good. And uh, okay, I have uh, three cameras on. I have uh, 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 Laura, I have uh, Miguel, I have uh, Graciela. Now I have Crazy Melara. Okay, and uh, Laura Raquel. Okay, so Brenda, are you there? Okay, uh, Marcela. Yes, Peter. <laughs> Marcela, how are you, Marcela? I'm pretty good. Oh my goodness, it's very dark. It's very dark <laughs> uh, what happened? Oh, there we go. There we go. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's, it's too romantic. Whenever you have the lights off, it's too romantic. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay, so um, welcome to your... Um, uh, English class, uh, we, we will go over our uh, uh, lesson from yesterday. Uh, we had uh, kind of a, an issue with uh, Zoom, but uh, hopefully today we will not have that type of uh, issues. And I do apologize for that inconvenience. Okay, today we are going to go over what we went yesterday. And um, what did we learn yesterday? Um, Brenda, do you remember anything in particular? that uh, we went over yesterday? The personal information. Personal information, we were practicing personal information. Yes, and what else, uh, Patricia Ayala? Hi, Patricia. Uh, can you turn the speaker on? Microphone. Coach. Hello? Hello, how are you? Fine, thank you for asking. Uh, uh, were you in class yesterday? Sorry, I have a dementia internet modem and I have been without oh, okay. internet. So, oh, okay. But, it's understandable. Okay. We hope but they have already. Okay, we hope everything comes together for you and that uh, uh, those issues will not happen to you because it's is uh, sometimes it happens, okay? So uh, don't you, worry. Teacher. Then um, I'm gonna ask Laura, Raquel, what did uh, what do you remember from yesterday? Um, uh, Brenda Cruz says that we went over personal information. Yes, we did. What else do you remember that we went over yesterday? The WH questions. WH questions, yes. That was uh, at the end of the class. And before that, uh, Chrissia Melara, what did we uh, went possessive, over? Possessive adjectives. Possessive adjectives, yes. Possessive adjectives, yes. Uh, who uh, does remember uh, what are the possessive adjectives? For example, his, my, her, yours, mine, 
His, her, yes, my, and, and yours. Yes, yours. what's the difference, uh, Miguel mine. Lara, between my Ours. and mine? Um, my eh, representa, uno es de, de propiedad. ¿Y el otro? El otro sería como, no sé cómo explicarlo. Ok, <laughs> deme un ejemplo. Uh, give me an example then. Eh, como uh, my house. Oh, this is car blue is mine. This car is mine. Yes, this car is mine. Yes, this car is. When it, whenever I am, uh, I am uh, trying to uh, make possession of something, then I say this car is mine. So, for example, we want to say that something is belongs to uh, Brenda. I will not say, Brenda, is this uh, hair? How do I say? Repeat me. Brenda, is this yours? Yes. I would say, Brenda, Brenda, is this yours? Because I'm uh, I'm telling that something, it belongs to her. That I cannot say, Brenda, is this hers? No, right? Because it is uh, a second person. When I'm uh, talking to her, she's a second person. Even though she's a lady, I will not use the her because it's a, I'm, I'm talking to a second person. Okay, so it different. Um, sometimes uh, it may be confused, but once you get uh, used to it, when you, you get the hangover, then uh, you will uh, see that uh, it becomes normal for you to use those possessive adjectives. Okay, and uh, also we were um, uh, we were talking about spelling the first day of class. How are we uh, doing with the spelling? Um, are we learning the alphabets? In, if none of you needs to learn the alphabets, uh, well, that's wonderful. But if you do need to learn it, don't put it aside, okay? Because it will not, the classes will not get easier. It will get harder and harder and harder. And if you're not, if you're not getting the, the, this is like the foundation for you. If you don't get the foundations, if you don't get the, the small stuff, then the harder stuff, what you're gonna do is gonna, you're gonna say, okay, I'm gonna give up. I give up, you know, I can't keep up with this. Uh, it's too much information now. Yes, it will become uh, too much information if you don't start working from now. Learning those little things that are the foundation for your learning process, okay? So if you need to uh, memorize the alphabet, do it okay. at your lunch time. Go ahead and repeat, repeat. When you, when you, if you're driving, repeat those uh, words. If you're, uh, 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 you know, uh, riding on the bus, then repeat the words. Even though if people say that you, you might be look like crazy right? <laughs> sometimes, but uh, it's for your own benefit. Okay, okay. Well, um, we will continue today with the. Uh, we're gonna do some knowledge check um, on the on the on the platform. Uh, to see if uh, everything is okay. If there is something that uh, I need to uh, help you understand, I will do it tonight. Or if you do have any question, please ask me. Por favor, uh, pregúntela si usted tiene algún, algo que no entiende, que no está muy claro, pregúntelo para que tal vez el, otras personas no lo están preguntando porque tienen pena. Acuérdense que esta es, this is your class. Okay, so don't hesitate to ask any question. Ok, Graciela, Laura, Brenda, Patricia, Crisia, Evelyn, hi Evelyn, Avilain, how are you, Marcela. Ok, so um, we will continue with the uh, WH question. Uh, uh, what WH question did we went over yesterday? ¿Se acuerdan las que, las que practicamos? ¿Cuáles fueron? Why? What? Yes, who, what? When, where? Okay. What? Why? When? What? Why? How? Why did we, we didn't go over why yesterday, right? Did we? No. No lo practicamos ayer, verdad? Okay. And uh, para no. qué usamos el what, Miguel? No. Um, para cosas. Para cosas. Para preguntar acerca de cosas. Y el who, para qué lo usamos, uh, Patricia? Patricia, Alaya, Ayala. Hi. Good night. Good evening. 
Are you living? Good evening, teacher. Y good evening. Good. Patricia, ¿para qué usamos el, el, el who? Es para preguntar. Sí, para preguntar. Ah, ok. Ah. Muy bien, para preguntar. ¿Para qué usamos el who? Ah, ¿Para qué clases de preguntas, Patricia? Ah, Acuérdense que... Eh, eh, de... Para preguntar eh, quién... Para personas, ah, correcto. Personas. Para, para personas, sí, yes. para personas. No vamos a usar el who para, para preguntar por un, un dog, un perro, ¿sí? No, who is that? No, who is the dog? No, eh, vamos a poner what is, what is, porque el dog se considera un thing, ¿verdad? Um, y el when, ¿para qué lo usamos, uh, Tirso Cermeño? When is for us, uh, it was. Uh, To time. Ah, yes. About time. About time. About time. About time. Yes. Whenever we want to know about time, then or, or place or, or dates, right? When did you graduate? When did you graduate? Yeah. When is your birthday party, Brenda Cruz? When is your birthday party? Yes. When are you going to the beach, Miguel? When? Huh? When? Uh, Uh, are you graduating from a university, Laura? Raquel? Yes. When are you going to take vacation, uh, Graciela Duarte? She's going to say never, right? Never. She's a businesswoman. Never. Never, never. Huh? Yes. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And, and when are you never. getting married, never. Elizabeth? Never, never. <laughs> when are you getting married, Elizabeth? Elizabeth Paris. Uh, repeat, teacher. When are you getting married? Uh, ah. Ah. Cuando es no. married, dijo. Uh, whenever. Married. Okay. Married. When are you getting getting married? Yes. Getting married. ¿Qué significa getting married, teacher? Okay. Cuando te vas a casar? Ah. Oh. Ah, ya. Ya, 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 ya te vas a casar? Now. 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 Oh my goodness, no. very good. Okay, you're, you're in a hurry, huh? Eh? That's the reason. Okay, so when is about time. Yeah, it's time. When is a, uh, is we ask about time. Remember, that is very important for you to know when to use each of the WH questions, okay? So we're gonna see the rest of them today. I'm gonna uh, uh, share screen with you. Share es compartir. Share the screen with you, okay? Let me know if you don't see it, please. Okay. Okay. Can you see it? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Number this is what we went to eight. yesterday. Who, what, why, where, when, how, and why. So we still have a which is where. Right there. Where. Yes, where. Okay. So this is a who is used to ask about people. A what is used to ask about things. Uh, when is used is, when it is used to ask about time, remember? And um, today we're gonna see where, where, where is used to ask about place. Okay. So for, for for example, I say, where are my books? So I'm asking for a place where I placed my books. Yes. Where are my books? They're on the desk. They're on the desk. So the, the, the answer to the question is going to be a place. Okay. Where is um, uh, Metro Centro? Uh, Laura, where is Metro Centro? Oh, Metro Centro is in, is in San Salvador. It's in San Salvador. Very good. Very good. Um, uh, where is uh, Volcani Salco, uh, Graciela Duarte? Uh, Volcanic Salco is in Sonsonate. Sonsonate. You can say volcano, right? Volcano. It will be in English. 
a volcano. Uh, yes, volcano will be in English. Yes, uh, Jacqueline, volcano. where is um, um where is um let's see Amapulapa. No, 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 where is Los Chorros then? Where is Los Chorros? Amapulapa is in El Salvador, I think. Where is Los yes, Chorros? In San Vicente. San Vicente, Los Chorros. Yes, no, Amapulapa. No. Amapulapa, okay. Uh, Marcela, where is Los Chorros? Es, um, la libertad. La libertad. Very good. Very good. Yes. Um, uh, I know this. Miguel doesn't know this. Miguel, where is uh, uh, Parque Daniel Hernández? In Santa Tecla. Santa Tecla. Yeah, there we go. My goodness. I thought you, you, you didn't know that. Okay. Yes. So where is about places? If I want to know about places, then I will use where. Where do you live? Remember? Where do you live? You're asking for a place where you are staying. So where do you live? So where is used to ask about places? Example. Okay, let's read this one, Patricia, please. Read the first one for me. Patricia, please. Prende el micrófono, por favor. Okay. My post office is um, homework. I am homework. La primera dice, where is my pencil case? Esta? My pencil case. Where is my pencil case? Case. Uh, where? Solo léela por mí. Read this one for ah. me. Where is my okay. pencil case? Where is my pencil case? Case, yes. Oh, your pencil case, I think is uh, on your desk. Yes. Pencil case es, es, una, es donde guardas tú los lápices. ¿Ya? Yeah? Lápices, porta lápices. Porta yes. That's a pencil case. So you're asking me where's your pencil case. Oh, Miguel, ask me the second one, please. Where is the post office? I think the post office, it is uh, next to Almacen uh, Siman, uh, I guess. Yes, uh, it used to be over there, but it doesn't exist anymore. Okay, thank you. Okay, Crisia Melara, third one. Where do you want to go? Well, I don't know. Last night we went to eat pizza, we went to eat seafood. Today I think I want to uh, I want to go to Kentucky Fried Chicken. Is that okay? <laughs> Is that okay? Yes, okay. Okay. No, I don't think it's not okay. You don't like that. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I want to go to Kentucky. Okay. Now um, let's see. Um, a, the next one I want uh, if you can help me, Marcela. Linares? Yeah. Uh, I have a question with where, right? Okay, Marcela, eh, uh, estamos en la cuarta pregunta. Ah, ah yeah, cuarta. Uh, where is El Salvador in the map? Yeah, in the map? Oh my goodness. Ah, it's next to Guatemala, uh, between Guatemala and Honduras. Yes, it's on the Pacific coast. Okay, Marcela. Thank you. Thank you, Marcela. Okay, so this okay. is now we're gonna go with why. Why is used to ask about reasons. Remember, why is all whenever you say why, what you're telling the other people is hey, give me a reason. You're telling me that. Okay, why are you so happy? I'm asking you, why are you so happy? What happened? Uh, that's what I'm asking you. I'm telling you, hey, what happened today to you? Why are you so happy? Oh, because I love English class. Yes, I love English class. So that is the reason why the person is happy. 
Yes. Uh, for example, if I said, uh, Elizabeth, why are you so quiet? Elizabeth, Avelyn. Uh, 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 why are you so happy? Okay. For, uh, tengo que responder okay. ahí, okay. o, re, o, o preguntar. Okay, okay, okay. Pongamos orden en la clase, por favor. Si vamos a estar trabajando en otra cosa que no sea, eh, apague la cámara, por así yo no le pregunto. Pero si va a estar en la clase, por favor ponga atención, porque cuando yo le hago la pregunta y usted me dice, ¿cuál pregunta me está haciendo? O me está contestando otra cosa que no es, eso quiere decir que usted no está poniendo atención. Y, y no es bueno, porque no, no, no está aprovechando su tiempo. Por favor, si va a estar en la clase, ponga atención. Esta es su clase. Entonces, aproveche su clase, aproveche su tiempo, ¿ok? Por favor, no esté viendo WhatsApp, no esté viendo eh, Facebook, no esté mandando mensajes. Ahorita es tiempo de la clase de inglés. Lo puede hacer después de la clase de inglés. Please, ¿ok? Ok. Ok, thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. Ok, entonces vamos a seguir, vamos a seguir con la, con la clase. Eh, estábamos en, en why. Why lo hacemos nosotros para preguntar, para uh, preguntar razón. Siempre que usted va a preguntar why, usted está exigiendo razones por qué está pasando. Por ejemplo, yo le digo, oh, Miguel, why are you so quiet? Y Miguel me dice, oh. Why are you so quiet, Miguel? Um, because I lie. Esa es la razón por la cual usted está callado. Yes. Okay. Entonces, una, eh, usted puede decir, why are you so quiet? Oh, teacher, I'm paying attention. I'm listening to you. Esa es la razón por la cual usted está callado, porque está poniendo atención, está escuchándome, está escuchando su, su, su clase, por eso es que está de esa manera. Ok, so I'm asking you for a reason, why are you like that? Yeah, uh, for example, I can say that, um, eh, um, let's see, let's see if I can pick someone else. Uh, Brenda, why are you so serious today? Because I pay attention in this class. Because I'm paying attention. Because I'm paying attention in the class, and I want to see what can I, uh, you know, find out about today's class. Very good. Okay. So why? Every time they ask you for a why, they are asking you for a reason. Make sure that you answer back with a reason why that whatever you're doing is happening. Okay. So let's continue. Um, let's see. Teacher, okay. teacher, yes, sorry, yes. teacher, I have a question. Okay, please. When you ask with why, you always, uh, you always to, to contestar con because. You reply with because, yes, because. Because, because. you're yes. always why? with because. Yes, uh -huh. yes, always is because. Okay. Yes. Why? Always because, because of this. Thank you. Because you're giving out the reason. Oh. Okay, for example, we have an example question. It says, why are you so sad? Si usted está triste, they say, why are you so sad? So, algo pasó, oh, because uh, um, I have problems at home. Oh, oh, um, one of my friends uh, just died, just passed away. Oh, because, uh, you know, my, my head hurt. Oh, okay, oh. I lost my job because I lost my job. I'm, I am so sad, okay? And I don't know what to do. So you're giving out reasons why you're so sad. For example, why was Antonio, Antonio is me, okay? My name is Antonio. So why was Antonio not at school yesterday? Oh, he said, because he said the uh, Zoom, you know, stopped working. That's the reason why he wasn't at school, okay? So why was Antonio not at school okay. yesterday? So I'm giving out a reason why. The other one, 
is why do we need to study English? Um, I'm asking you, uh, Patricia, why do you need to study English? I'm asking you for a reason, yeah? And you say, because? Because um, I like uh, English. Because I like English, yes. Okay, so let's see, um, um, let's see if I can ask somebody else, why, uh, why do you need to study English, Marcela Linares? Uh, because if I know uh, English, uh, um, probably I have more opportunities. There we go. Like yes. jobs. There we go. Very good. Excellent. Yes. Why do you need to study English? Because it opens up more opportunities for me. So that's the reason why you uh, study English. You need to study English. Very good. Excellent. So um, let's see. Why do you need to study English, uh, Raquel Cornejo? Well, um, I need to study English for, uh, for get a better job. Because I want to get a better job. Yes. Mm -hmm. Why do you need to study English? Because I want to get a better job. That's a good reason. Very good. And Graciela, why do you need to study English? Because I want to teach Spanish. You want to teach some yes. academy in Suchitoto. Oh, very yes. good. Because you want to teach because Spanish. Because in Suchitoto there are there, there are many strangers. Strangers or yes. foreigners? Foreigners. Foreigners, sorry. Foreigners. Yeah, foreigners. Yeah, they go. Yes. Very good. Yeah, that's a good reason. And yeah. I want to very good. Excellent. Okay, very good. Um, why do you think um she did that. Uh, um, why do you think she did that, uh, uh, Sermeño? Uh, why? Why uh, do you think she did that? Because she liked to teach language. She liked to teach English, yes. That's a good, that's a good reason, because she likes to teach uh, English. Uh, she likes, right? She likes to teach English uh, in another language. Very good, excellent. Okay, so why? I think why is very um, simple for you guys. I, I think you, you got the concept. Now we're gonna see which, because the which sometimes is uh, is is confused. Uh, it's, it's confusing. Which we think that which we use it for many things, but the which is used to ask about choice. Okay, a choice between one and another thing. Uh, which one do you want? If, if we have two, two figures, I have a square, a rectangle one and a circle one, oh, I have a green one and a blue one, then which one do you want? And you say, oh, I want the blue one. Yes, the blue one. Always, always put the one, because if you, you say, I want the blue, the blue what? The one? is the adjective, the blue one, yes? Yes, the blue one. Blue, I'm specifying which one, and one is the thing, the one thing, okay? So which is option between two things? Any questions about that? No? We okay? Okay, so examples. No, no questions. Yes. Examples on, example question. Which teacher do you like the most? So if I ask you, uh, Sermenio, Sermenio uh, could you please t tell me which teacher do you like the most? The teacher that I like most, the most? is the most, is the Licenciado Vidal. Oh, listen, oh my goodness. Okay, let's go home now. <laughs> let's go home now. Okay, so you, you're, comparing, you're comparing between two teachers, right? 
because licenciado Vidal, uh, okay, with the other teacher, you're comparing, well, the, the previous one, oh, I didn't like the one the last year, but yes, I like uh, licenciado Vidal. Very, very good, good question, good answer. Very good. Okay, uh, okay, um, Krisa, which of my books would you like to borrow? I have math and English. Which of my books would you like to borrow? Borrow es prestar. Cuando yo le hablo a usted, can you lend me five dollars? Lend me five dollars. Es, me puede prestar cinco dólares. Y cuando digo borrow, es cuando usted me quiere prestar, de mí quiere prestar algo. Can I borrow five dollars, teacher? Me puede prestar cinco dólares. O, do you want me to lend you five dollars, teacher? Quiere que le preste cinco dólares. Entonces, en este caso, yo tengo dos libros y le digo, which of my books would you like to borrow? Y tengo uno de, uh, let's say, science and English. Which book would you like to borrow? Uh, I like to borrow the English book. English book or English one. Yes, English one. Okay. Yes. One. Okay, very good. Very good. Okay. Um, okay, Marcela. We have Tony's Romans and Taco Bell. Okay. Which restaurant mm -hmm. shall we go to? Uh, Taco Bell's. Taco Bell. One. Okay, very yeah, good. Taco, Taco Bell. Bell. Okay, see, you have two options. You have uh, Tony Romans and Taco Bell. You say, run for the border, right? Taco Bell. Very good. Okay, okay. two options. And um, eh, Patricia, which way is uh, to Salvador del Mundo? You say, that way. Oh, that way. Oh, this way. The other way. Yes. The other way. <laughs> yeah, the other way. Okay, very good. Okay, which is used for option, for choice. Remember that, okay? Which one? For choice. Any question about which? No? You're okay? Very, very no, good. not yet. Okay. How? How is used to ask about the way something is done? For example, how do you make pupusas? Yes, Brenda, how do you make pupusas? Mm, no. How do you make pupusas? No, I don't. Uh, I don't make. I don't know. Pupusas. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Si sí, sí sabes lo que le pregunté, ¿verdad? Sí, podía hacer pupusas, me no. preguntó. No. no. How is como. Ah, ¿Cómo okay. hace las pupusas? I, I don't know. <laughs> yes, there we go. I don't know, teacher. I'm, I never make pupusas. Never. No. Okay, Laura, Laura, how do you make pupusas? Uh, well, I I don't know because I, I never I never made pupusas. Too. <laughs> Very good. Just I buy I buy it. <laughs> okay, okay. Very good. So I think so. Oh, how is used to ask the way something is done? Okay, the la forma como algo es hecho. Por eso se usa el how. Yeah, y también. The condition of something. How do you how do you like your coffee? Eh, Marcela, how do you like your coffee? Uh, well, uh, do, um, sugar with sugar. Okay, I like sweet. I like my coffee. I sweet. like sweet. Yes. Okay. Uh, oh, I like my coffee. Uh, dark. Oh, I like uh, my coffee with cream. Condition. Remember condition. La condición de algo. How? Yes. Sweet or sour? Or, Sweet. Yes. Or bitter. Bitter. Amargo. Yes. So how do you... Hey, um, no, Chris, Chrisia, how do you go to work? Repeat, please. How do you go to work? 
Uh, no, I don't work. I only study. Okay, how do you go to school? Hi, thanks. Hmm, I'm sorry. How do you go yes, to school? It was fine. How do you go to school? Okay. How do you go to school? Uh, I go to a school. No lo escuché. I go to school. Okay, se fue. Miguel Lara, how do you go to work? In car, teacher. By car. By car. Yes. By car. Very good. Okay, the condition, right? And uh, sometimes uh, the way things is done. Okay, sometimes or the degree of something. The degree. Oh, how, how painful is uh, a divorce? How painful is a divorce? That would be a degree, right? The degree of something. How painful is a divorce? So, le estoy preguntando que, que tan doloroso es un divorcio. Eso no se puede contar, no se puede contar the contabilizable entonces oh. is the degree of something el degree of something so el how se usa para esas tres cosas primero the way something is done the condition of something and the degree of something yes esas tres cosas tienen que aprendérselas y, y diferenciar okay how degree of something condition of something or the way something is done Entonces, acuérdese, how, how to, do you make pupusas? Okay, this is the way something is done. The condition, how do you like my coffee? Do I like it hot or cold or warm? This is the condition. The degree is que tanto, eh? el degree, que tanto me duele algo, yes? How, how, uh, how painful is your headache? Okay. Is it the degree of something? Okay. Okay. How was your vacation? Um, anybody took a vacation lately? Alguno ha tomado alguna vacación últimamente? No? No. No. Okay. Cermeño. Cermeño. Uh, when are you going to take uh, your vacation? My vacation when maybe yeah. in, maybe in two two weeks in two weeks uh, where two weeks more. okay where are you planning to go where maybe I will go, maybe I will go to Chalatenango Chalatenango very good Chalatenango. And very good and Gra Graciela and yes um are you taking any vacations lately <laughs> no. No? I can't take vacations. What about uh, December 25th, 24th? No? Uh, maybe only that day I will uh, sleep all day long. Oh my God. Okay. Okay. Very good. I think it's a good decision. It's a good decision. Very good. Yes. Okay. So, how? Any question about uh, the use of how? No? We're okay? Uh, okay. I have a question. I yes. have a question. Please. Yes. Uh huh. Sometimes how we can use uh, how many and how much, right? Yes, uh -huh. that will be the degree. And, ah, that's that's. It. But I, I have a question: How many, how much equals same? But how many you can use when is quantity, right? Quantity, yes, and uh -huh. how much when we cannot quant quant Un uncountable. Countable, countable. And that's right. Uncountable. Yes. Uh -huh. Okay. That's only. Okay. Thanks. But yes, how is in that case will be the degree of something. How much the degree of how many the degree of how many. Okay. Very good. Okay. How can I improve my English? What would be that uh, uh, question, uh, uh, Patricia? It would be. The way of something is done, the condition of something, or the degree of something. 
The condition is something. The condition. Uh, what do you think, uh, Sermeño? How can uh, I improve I my I, English? Huh? I think it's a degree. The degree. Yes. Degree. How can I improve? Yes. Yes. If if I if I study more, yeah, the degree of if I study more, then I will improve my. If I read a lot, then I will improve my my English. Yes. How can I improve my English? Can can be a yes. The degree of something. How often do you exercise, uh, Marcela Linares? How often? How often do you exercise? Often. What mean often? Often is a, a menudo. Que tan a menudo? Ah, yeah. Uh, I practice my English, right? How often do you exercise? One, two, three. Ah, four, exercise. Four, ah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, I. Um, three times. On week? Three times a week. Very good. Three times a week. Very good. Three times. That would be condition, way, or degree. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Uh, let's help. Uh, let's help her, Miguel. That would be condition, the way, or degree. Degree. The degree, something. Yes, very good. How far is the restaurant, uh, um, Chris, Crisela Melara? How far is, uh, um, let's say, uh, uh, Pollo Campero restaurant? It's a 30 minutes to my house. Okay, so ten, a 10 minutes walk or driving? Uh, walk. Walking, okay, walking, very good. Well, and that, in Aveline, Elizabeth, that would be a degree, way, or condition? Uh, degree. A degree, very good. Okay, and how do you cook pupusas? Uh, uh, who can I ask? Because let's see, who, who makes pupusas over here? Uh, Marcela, no. Graciela Duarte, how do you cook pupusas? With some, uh, how do you say harina? Da, da, da. Of uh, harina de maíz, a top of um, corn da, corn da. Corn da. Uh -huh. With cheese and beans, cheese. you Very can good. you can take it off mm -hmm. and you begin to I don't know how to say smash it, it. Uh, smash it, smash it. it. Then smash it. Mm -hmm. you are going to put. In the um, you're going to put the beans or cheese uh -huh. if you cheese. want or other thing. Okay. Then you are you make the I don't know the bolita. The ball, the ball, the then, ball. Yes. The ball. Yeah. Ball. The little ball, and then you with your with your two with hands you yeah. begin to palm, palm. Okay. Uh -huh. Palm. Yes. Okay. okay, and then you put on the on the pan? Come on, I don't know. On the pan? On the pan. Okay. With a little uh, oil. Because oil, you put some oil. Yes, there we go. Yes, very good. Oil, para que no se pegue. My goodness. That's right. Okay, now we, we have the recipe for to make pupusas. Let's see. Um, Brenda Cruz. Now you, you can try to make pupusas. Now that you know the recipe, okay? Oh, now, my question for you, Brenda, is, uh, is that a condition, way, or degree? The condition. The condition? Okay, let's see. Um, let's see, is that a condition, um, way or degree, uh, teacher? Who's the teacher here? You. Okay. Is that a way, a condition, or degree? Degree. It's a way. It's a way. Yes, it's a way. Es la forma como se hace la pupusa. Yes. Entonces es es como un proceso. It's the way 
How do you make it through a system? Okay. Degree. degree is cuando es algo measurable, cuando está mediendo algo, yeah? In condition is como se la quiero. O sea, how do you like your proposals? Oh, I like them uh, hot. That is a condition, yes? How do you like your proposals? I like them uh, hot. Oh, I like them uh, warm, <laughs> yes? So that's that's the difference between a wet condition. Very good, excellent. Oh my goodness. Now we're gonna see how uh, we can do the, the quiz. I wanna volunteer for the question number one, the first one. Who wants to volunteer to answer this one? Me, teacher. Okay, please go ahead, read it. Where is my pencil? Uh huh. It's under the chair. The chair, yes. Where, where is my pencil? So we use where. Why do we use uh, use where, uh, Patricia? Prende el micrófono, Patricia. Yala, por favor. Why do we use where? Um, no lo escuché, pero okay. Brenda Cruz, ayúdele por favor. Why do we use where? Because uh, because it's a place where because, yes the, yes we're the, we're asking for a place where the pencil is, right? Yes. Very good, excellent. Uh, Patricia, we're asking for a place where, okay? Now, next one. See, where is my pencil? It's under the chair. Okay, next one, number two. Who wants to volunteer for this one? Me. Okay, go ahead, please. Um, who is she? Who is she? And the answer is? She is my sister. It's my sister. Now, uh, Patricia Ayala, again. Why do we we use who? Um, who, who, um, who is he? Why do we use who? Um, Why do we use, do you need help? Do you want uh, uh, Mr. Cermeño to help you? Yes, yes. Uh, we use uh, who because we are, we are talking about a person. We are talking about a person. There we go. Estamos hablando de una persona. That's the reason why we use who, Patricia. Okay, now, who wants to volunteer for number three? Un voluntario para el número tres. Anybody? Me. Me. Okay, go Me ahead, teacher. please. Thank you. Uh, what do you want to eat? What? I want some pizza. Very good. What do you want to eat? Okay. Why do we use uh, uh, what, uh, teacher? Because it's a. I'm sorry? It's a thing. You it's are talking. Thing. Yes, there we go. Yeah, well, yes, it's a thing. Uh, even though we're, we're talking about eat, but we are talking about what do you want to eat? ¿Qué es lo que quieres comer? Entonces, a thing is pizza, cheeseburger, uh, Kentucky Fried Chicken, Taco Bell, this isn't a thing, right? Entonces la comida is not a thing. That's the reason why we use what? Very good, excellent. Oh my goodness, you guys are good. Okay, any volunteer for this one? Okay, please when go does the movie start? I'm sorry? When does the movie start? Uh-huh. When does... The movie star, yes. it starts in five minutes. Yes, it starts in five minutes. Yes. 
when and why do we use uh, when uh, uh, Miguel because it's time because we are looking for time we're asking for time very good excellent oh my goodness Marcela are you bored okay Marcela go ahead try this one uh, why are you crying because the story is so bad it's so sad very good why are you crying because the story is so sad and Patricia why do we use why over here para que se usa why Yes, why are we using why? Why? Um, para preguntar. preguntar. Para questions. Para... Okay, alguien le puede ayudar? Evelyn, Elizabeth. Uh, um, Why are you crying? Por Por qué the why? Crying is his palabra, right, teacher? Llorando. Ah, llorando. Okay. 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 Porque Okay. 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 Uh, we are looking for a reason. Yes. The reason why she's crying is because she's sad. So we're looking for a reason. That's the reason why we use why. Because we want to find out the reason. Very good. Very good. It's like you're working as a team. Very good. Excellent. Why are you crying? Very good. What about this one, um, Elizabeth? Yeah, don't translate. Yes. Why? 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 Why as the food? Why was the food? Um, okay, Miguel, que no estás convencido. Miguel, can you help her? What was the food? Huh? How was the food? How was the food? And the, the answer is? It was delicious. It was delicious. How was the food? So it's asking for a degree, right? How was the food? How was it? It was delicious. So it was, it was not good. It wasn't that good. I didn't like it, yes? So it's asking for a, a, a degree of it. How was the food? Very good, excellent. Okay, well, let's see. Uh, Crisa Melara, help me on this one. Which one? Which one do you want? Chocolate or vanilla ice cream? Chocolate, please. Very good. Which one do you want? Chocolate or vanilla ice cream? Uh, chocolate, please. Okay. Very good. How do you know, um, Crisella, that uh, which is the one we want to use? Sorry, teacher. Graciela. Did you say Graciela? Chris, Crisia. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. No, that's okay. Because uh, you are compared to things? Yes, very good. Because you are talking about two things. Yeah, you're choosing. You have a choice between two things. So you just wish. Very good. My goodness, you're good. Teacher, help me on this one, please. Where is the bank? Where is the... Okay. And the answer is? Uh, go straight and turn left. Yes, go straight and turn left. Yes. Mete derecho y hace una izquierda, right? Very good. And um, how, why did you use uh, where? Uh, 
Oh. We're talking about the place. A place. We are talking about a place. Yes. I want to find out a place. Okay, Brenda Cruz. Brenda. Carry forward. Brenda. When is their birthday? It's February 5th. Very good. When is your birthday? It's February 5th. And how did you, know you have to use when, uh, Brenda? Uh, because talking about uh, date. Because they're talking about date. And whenever we use a time or date, then it's when, right? We uh, want to find out. And this one, I want to thank you for this, please. Me. Okay. Uh, why are you late? Because I missed the bus. Yes, very good. Why are we using why? Why? Well, because because we need to get information. We want a reason. We want a reason or information. Maybe. Yes, I want a reason why he was late. Porque llegó tarde, right? I want a reason. Right. Uh, so whenever I ask you. Uh, Brenda, why are you late? I'm not, uh, I'm not uh, pointing at you or I'm not, uh, you know, trying to make you feel bad. I just want a reason. Eh? Why are you late? Oh, because, teacher, because, you know, my car broke down. And, and uh, I don't know, my friend didn't get uh, uh, for me on time. No. A reason, right? It's nothing wrong. Very good. Excellent. Okay. So any questions about uh, good job? Good job. Very good. Good job. Okay. Um, any question about uh, this uh, WH question and answer? Do we have a, a better understanding of them? Tenemos más o menos una mejor una mejor eh, percepción de las WH questions. Okay. Alguna pregunta? Yes, teacher. Yes. No, thank you. No. Okay, le voy a le voy a enviar esta 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 presentación a ustedes para no, que okay. la la puedan ver. Ahora en la plataforma, eh, alguien ha tenido problemas en la plataforma. Algún ejercicio que quieran que, que que lo veamos. No. Okay. No. Perdón. No. Everything is okay. No, okay. No. Más, más o menos, más o menos, no es que así tiene que ser, más o menos uh, por cada clase nosotros tenemos que cubrir a uh, cinco, como por ejemplo de la sección uno, uno al cinco, primer día, de cinco al diez, segundo día, diez al quince, eh, si hay quince, ¿verdad? Tercer día. Entonces, así es como lo he calculado más o menos para que vayamos on time. Eh, quiere decir que este es nuestro third day. Ya usted tiene que estar en la, en la sección 2.5, ya. Ya, ya te, he terminado todos los ejercicios de la plataforma hasta el 2.5 para ir más o menos al, al, al día. Yes. Si usted no va ahí todavía, quiere decir que está behind. ¿Qué es behind? Brenda. Behind. Yes, si, si usted no está en el 2.5 ahorita, atrás. You are behind. Mm -hmm. Atrasado. Atrás. Atrasado. Yeah. Está atrasado. Entonces, si no va por ahí, um, trate de, de, de ponerse al día. Ya el lunes, ya tiene que estar en el 2.10. ¿Sí? Martes 2. Si llega hasta el 15, 2.15. Y así sucesivamente, más o menos, ¿verdad? Eso es lo que lo he compartido. En las clases que yo les estoy dando, estoy tratando de cumplir todos esos puntos para que usted cuando esté haciendo ejercicio, ya más o menos, ah, esto ya lo vi, oh, ya esto ya me acuerdo cómo va. Y si tiene alguna pregunta, por favor, no se, no, no se, no se mortifique, eh, mándeme un mensaje, una llamada y ya le digo, podemos hacer una videoconferencia de Zoom uno a uno. Para, para ver que, que se aclare cualquier duda, ¿ok? Les agradezco mucho que siempre están en el tiempo. Ah, es un buen grupo, eh, participan bastante y eso es lo que me gusta. A veces ah, 
nos distraemos, pero es parte del, del cansancio. Yo lo entiendo mucho. Les agradezco que aún a esta hora todavía están con, con ganas de aprendiendo. Así que felicitaciones para ustedes, un aplauso para cada uno de ustedes. Y hay que echarle más ganas, ¿verdad? Démosle más ganas y, y vamos a salir juntos en esto. Hasta la otra lado de la orilla, hasta que ustedes aprendan inglés, lo voy a dejar. Ya cuando ustedes estén hablando uh -huh. inglés como hablan el español, hasta entonces ya les voy a decir, ok, ya, ya estuvo, ya, ya. Pero mientras no, mientras no estén ahí, siempre voy a estar diciendo lo que necesitan, ok, ayudándoles, apoyándoles en lo que usted necesita, ok. Thumbs up, thumbs up es de los thumbs up, ok, very good, ok, good. si no me preguntan, good evening, I'll see you Monday, okay, have a nice weekend, enjoy your weekend. Have a nice weekend too. Ok, chao, chao, bye. Chao, everybody. Bye. Chao. Chao.